uh, squat or reach. You can use a chair for this if you want. The only reason I like the chair is because it kind of gives you an end point, but don't feel like you have to do that. So we're just going to squat down. If you have the chair behind you, just lightly touch. Don't actually sit on it. And then squeeze your shoulder blades when you stand up. We're going to do 15 of these. If the chair feels too low, you could always put a cushion on it or something like that too. But usually a good end point for your squat. Of course, y'all know I can't talk and count. So let's go three more. All right. And then you got to do some nice big back steps, backward lunge. Let's try to get 10 on each side. Big step backwards. Reach up over your head as you step. Squeeze the glute on the back leg as much as possible. Don't feel like you have to go down real far. If you want to, you can. But that is optional. Of course, feel free to hold on to your chair rather than reaching if that feels better for you. All right, let's do one more on each side. I apologize once again if that was not exactly 10. All right, and let's get some hamstring scoops. So a little bit of a bend in one side. Reach down, scoop it up, and step away from the wall a little bit. You should feel a nice gentle stretch in the back of that straight leg. Oh, three more on this side. All right, other side.
Let's go three more. All right, last one. And then we're going to go squat, step back, squat, step back. Unfortunately, I lost that already. Gosh darn it. That's all right. Let's go three more. When I lose count, I lose balance. Huh. That's one. All right. And then we're going to come over to the chair. And let's get some chair push-ups. You keep them shallow as you want. Let's try to get five more. All right, let's come back to our first line. So everything but the warm up at first. We're going side step lunge. Let's we'll start on this side first. Three more. All right, other side. All right, now we got these crossovers. You can also do these holding on to a chair if you feel more comfortable doing that. And don't feel like you have to go down that far. These are just great for opening up your hips. Let's try three more. All right. Now for these squats, I'll go ahead and face this way this time. So we're gonna squat. If you can reach up, that's great. If not, don't worry about it. Of course, if you want to grab a chair, you can do it this way. If you feel a little more comfortable that way, Whatever 
feels best for you. All right, let's get two more. All right, last one. And if you're using the chair, flip it over. Let's go ahead and get those push ups. I'm gonna try five more. All right. If you have to hop, go ahead. I'm gonna try to go through it one more time for anyone who wants to stay. So our lateral step one, just the first one. We'll do less this time now. How about three more? All right, other side. We'll just do 10. All right. Last one. Those are a great balance challenge sometimes too. All Let's get two more. All right, one more quick set of push-ups. We will definitely call it a day. All right. 